good morning and happy Sunday. Today is a first alert weather day because of the risk for storms we're looking at later on this afternoon and evening. Yeah, we do have a few pop up showers right now, but nothing severe. These are going to occur when a cold front moves through. That's going to be at about four o'clock with damaging winds, hail and even an isolated tornado, especially north of I 80. Today is also going to be very hot, so it's going to be unsettled. Already seeing those storms well to the north, crossing the Great Lakes with that short wave. So we are getting a few of those pop up showers right now and actually looking just now a severe thunderstorm warning popping up for areas south of I 70 and that is for northern parts of Green County and then also into parts of Westmoreland County that goes until 8 o'clock this morning. So still 45 minutes left before these are going to occur and start to move into that area. So with that, we could still have some damaging winds, but these are very isolated already seeing those storms that were in Beaver County early this morning and are now into southern parts of Butler County, even northern of Allegheny County towards the Seven Fields area. Those are already weakening a bit, so this could expire early, but right now that is going to continue until 8 8 o'clock, so I'm going to keep a close eye on that through the morning. Looking at New Kensington now seeing a few pockets of heavier rain. We've got one lightning strike there, but these are lasting maybe about 10 minutes and then moving on. Right now we're at 70 degrees. Winds are calm. Started off in the upper 60s. It is still mild and muggy, but a few of those isolated storms are the biggest trend this morning. We still have some sunshine out there, so if you're north, get out and enjoy it right now. Indiana 68, 70, Latrobe. Go out, maybe walk the dog, and then if you do have plans today, I wouldn't cancel. Just make sure you have a plan in place for when those storms do roll through later on this afternoon and evening. We're going for 92 today. Yesterday we only made it to 89. Rain did cool things down a little bit. There were a few places that got to 90. So looking at our muggy meter, very humid today, extremely humid, and then we catch relief once that cold front pushes through. So the best day of the week looks to be Tuesday. We just have to get through this round of rain and storms. This will be at about 3, 4 o'clock. They'll be more numerous for areas north of I-80. So a lot of areas north stay weather aware for this afternoon into the early evening. Again, an isolated tornado can't be ruled out. Damaging winds over 60 miles per hour, the biggest threat, and then even some small hail. Further south you go, the less risk of severe weather, but by 8 o'clock tonight, we still have that quick round move through. Convection will be dying down at that point, but even overnight tonight, you may be woken up by some rumbles of thunder with another quick burst of rain that's going to move through. These are going to shift off to the southeast, weaken as they do so. Could even have a few of those lasting through very early tomorrow for the first part of the day, and then things will quiet down. But tonight, 68 degrees, we will still have some rain and some thunderstorms hanging on. So right now, just again, we have that severe thunderstorm warning for areas south of I-70, just a small cell moving through. Temperatures today, 92 for the afternoon, 84 tomorrow with early showers rolling out. And then Tuesday, a lot more comfortable, 81 degrees, 82 Wednesday. We will have some scattered showers around, a few storms around Thursday and Friday in the low 80s. And we get that all out of the way for the weekend. Saturday, mostly sunny with highs in the low 80s.